this is where it finally ended, one man's mission to raise money to fight cancer. 10 days of paddling over the open ocean from Santa Barbara to Newport Harbor, a total of 150 miles. During chemo, I used to dream of what would be worse than what I was going through. Paddling long distances is close. While recovering from Hodgkin's lymphoma and damaged vocal cords, 30-year-old Jack Shimko saw an opportunity to help others. Soon, Paddle to Live was underway. Jack's uncle is a Hollywood filmmaker and documents the journey to help spread the word. The Quicksilver Foundation makes sure 100% of the proceeds goes directly to cancer research and treatment. A family friend offers the Bear Flag commercial fishing boat for the film crew and Jack's support team. Cancer won't go away if I paddle 25 miles today. It won't lay down and die impressed with my accomplishment. But every day that I search for it, I create a ripple. Aside from the grueling distance of each leg, Jack also has to deal with the creatures that lurk in these deep waters. Some looking for prey, others just looking for a playmate. There is no home stretch for cancer patients, no destination, because there is no cure. My paddle is done, but our work is just beginning. After paddling the last nine hours from Catalina, Jack carries his own board out of the water. That's no surprise to those who know Jack. He's been full of strength and determination his entire life. And right now, he's already planning next year's event. You can keep track of Jack's mission to fight cancer at paddletolive.org. In Newport Beach, this is Valerie Starn reporting.